planet Mars, dog. My planet raw. Took trips and landed far. Took hits I can't ignore. So I wanted to get a tattoo while skydiving, while in the air, while falling 120 miles an hour towards the earth, plummeting towards my death. I want to get a tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> Before I do that, you may notice that my beard has got a lot longer. Let's get on with this video. If I want to get a tattoo while skydiving, I've actually got to learn to skydive. So in two and a half weeks from right now of me recording this, I am going to be doing my first lessons which sounds crazy but it's happening so i thought the most logical thing to do is to go do them indoor skydive things to get a feel for it get a feel for like the body movements and stuff to stay still before i actually jump out of plane Fifteen thousand feet up there so uh yeah that's where i'm going today me and moon we're gonna go i'm gonna do some indoor skydiving i'm also going again next week and i'm also going again the day before my first Lesson. Let's just, let's go. I'm going to vlog the whole thing. Let's have some fun and let's uh, go get a skydiving license. <laughs> Still, I can't believe it. It don't sound right. <laughs> I spy with my little eye something no. beginning with. Oh my god! But the only thing we're wearing these masks, I can just smell my own bad breath. I know, I, I can't, can't get away from it. I just sneezed and like I basically sneezed on myself. <laughs> <laughs> we were all wet. Whoa, vegan, vegan waffles, Moon. Yeah. Vegan milkshake. Oh, I want to try it. Let's get a waffle. Let's get a waffle. We're on a diet, Moon. We shouldn't be here. Wait, if it's not on camera, it don't count. Off, off. It didn't happen if it's not on camera. Off. Mm. Oh, it's really nice. Stop it. No. no. Stop. Are you wearing trainers today? Yeah. No previous shoulder injuries on this occasion. No, no. I can't get my shoe through. You want to take your foot, shoe off? No, no. I gotta wear a helmet and goggles, earplugs, and what's that? It's for your hair, Thomas. It's a hairnet. Wow, you rock it. Wow. <laughs> you know, I'm taking these home. Yeah, why? What? Why? What? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so you don't hear me in it. What? Oh, you're in it. Oh, you've got an extra large suit as well. <laughs> it says extra large on the back. <laughs> so yeah, I just jumped straight in and as you can see, I'm an absolute natural idiot. I just caught hang of it straight away. I just started doing flips, back flips. I just became an airborne wizard basically. I found my new talent. I didn't really. That's me over there watching. And this was a different day. Here's me on my first try. Did so much worse than I thought I was gonna do. How bad were I, Moon? How did it feel for you? Because I can't describe it. Kind of like this. Yeah, that's, like a, that's how it looked. It looked like you did not have any nah. control over your body, like I none. I'm jumping out of a plane in two and a half weeks, Moon. No bad, though. All right, so here we go. This is the next week. It's been a week. I'm here for round two of the indoor skydive practice. I'm on my own. No one will come with me. No one will come with me. So I'm here by myself, but it doesn't matter. I'm here a bit early, so I'm coming to a shopping centre. I'm going to have some fun by myself. It's going to be a really good day, all by myself, alone. It's going to be awesome.
Alright, so I did something a little different this time. What I did is I told the guy that I was practicing for my skydiving license and he laid me on the floor with the fan a little bit lower. You can see here it, it was practicing me doing twists and turns. I pretended that I was uh, opening my parachute. I even going up and down at some point which was pretty cool as well. A week later, I went back again. I took my dad for a laugh. I did my twists and turns and stuff like I was doing the week before. But look at this, look at this. My dad absolutely nailed it. Look at that, it's embarrassing. He put me to shame, bro. He put me to shame. <laughs> this is it, the big day, the ground school day, where I'm just literally in a classroom, learning over theory, how to do a parachute, you know, how to, how to do a parachute. Cause that's the correct way how you say it. <laughs> what is it? What's it called? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> how to put your parachute. What to do in an emergency situation. And then there's gonna be a written test at the end. So the pressure is on. If the weather is good, tomorrow will be the day when we start doing the jumps. <laughs> okay, here we go, I'm gonna go over to reception, hand my form in that says if I die, it's not their fault. And then I begin. <laughs> I've got this manual, if you can see. I've got to like, memorize all these, these hand signals and stuff. You've got to practice opening your parachute. There's a list of things you've got to do and you've got to read it to them and you've got to memorize it in that exact order and I'm rubbish at memorizing things. Then you've got to like, memorize the landing spots. There's loads to do. I'm on my dinner break right now. I'm just eating my sandwiches. I've got to go because I'm going to be late. It's just, they just jam information in your cranium. Your boy only got it past! I don't know why I'm showing you that, because it's not. I, I feel like I should have got a certificate, but I got nothing to show. I passed. I didn't just pass. I got 100%. I got every single question right. And I was the star pupil. Your boy was the star pupil. Damn, that don't make me sound cool, does it? Damn, that makes me sound like a nerd. Um, I just scraped through, you know, I don't care. Just scraped through, just made it, you know, and, and uh, I'm gonna jump from an airplane at 15,000 feet tomorrow. I was star pupil. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Your boy got his national skydiving license. Look at that, bro. Thomas Staniland, that's me. Got my picture in there because I'm growing my beard right now because of this three million thing. I'm going to be stuck with that photo forever now. So all those clips you've just seen of me skydiving, it, that weren't like one day. That was like two months. That's to be perfect weather to go skydiving. And as you can see right now, it's not perfect weather. You're not meant to jump in all the clouds and stuff. And there's just like a sea of cloud, wind, rain is pretty much that for the next two weeks as well and i want to get this video done so what i'm gonna do is we're gonna go somewhere else So if you didn't if you didn't get it from that last little weird thing I filmed, we're in America right now, USA. It is the big day, and I'm I'm dressed, I'm ready to go, ready to do this thing. This is the tattoo gun. Here it is. Got a battery pack on there. Got it on some uh, duct tape with some string going around it. So if I drop it, I can still keep hold of it. <laughs> Today is the big day. So yeah, I got my tattoo gun. I'm ready to go. We're gonna be jumping from 22,000 feet. 22,000, we've done some practice jumps at 13,000. So, uh, let's uh, do this. <laughs> let's tattoo myself while falling. 22,000 feet. 
Yo, alright, so I'm just uh, editing this video and I realised I didn't show you what tattoo I'm going to be attempting to do on myself. Here is what I'm going to be attempting. I'm going to be attempting this on my arm. It's like a basic parachute, I mean, you know, so... This should be good to go. Nice and easy, I guess. Okay, so Carlos Jr., you hungry? I can do a Carlos, yeah. I turned camera on and I said, ask me some questions, and then they asked me what food I want. I don't know if you can hear the shooting as well. Yeah, they've got a skydiving place right next to a shooting range. I'm ready. For Carl's bitch. Tattoo in style. There we go. Hell yeah, man. Yeah, nice, man. nice ink work. Ah, I'll get my first tattoo from you. <laughs> I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> How do you feel about that? Hey, that's the first time I've seen that happen. I have a case of beer too, man. That was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. That could be the highest tattoo ever, yeah, ever we, written, you know? I think we broke some records. Oh, nice. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe we did it. I can't believe we did it. Look at this. Are you ready? It's been a couple days. That's what it looks like now. The redness has gone. Not a lot of ink's actually gone in. I'm quite glad though, because it looks a complete mess. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a Santa Monica Beach. There's the pier. It's like from GTA. It don't feel real. So yeah, anyway, I hope you've enjoyed the video. Just look at this before you go. Look at this. I've got this. This is mine. I'm about to set off on it. I'm going to cross America on this thing. It's going to take over a month. So yeah, I'll keep checking back here for updates. And like in over a month, there's going to be a video of me crossing America on this. Come on, baby. Let's go. I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>